Hello and thank you for checking out my video on how to create and add an eBay product display onto your website. Now basically that's a lot of words saying how to add a live eBay listing to your website and the, one of the better reasons why you're going to do this or want to do this is to be able to earn affiliate commissions on whatever is sold on eBay uh, to the people that got there from your website uh, through these uh, affiliate links and the first thing you want to do is you want to go to Commission Junction kind of move this down so you can see what I'm talking about it's uh, www.cj.com and you want to sign up here as a member it doesn't cost you a dime it's completely free and a lot of benefits in addition to just the eBay affiliate links because th these guys here on Commission Junction they've got a whole bunch of advertisers that's here um, that you can earn a healthy income just from referring people to their sites. Uh, what you want to do is under publishers you want to click here and it's like most anything else you're signing up for uh, you fill in all the blanks, uh, email, mailing address, blah 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 and then they send you a confirmation email, you click on that everything's hunky-dory, you stick your username and your password in here and you uh, um, then you come to the login page and that would be the home section here and what you want to do at that point is go to account then website settings because all the websites that you want to put your uh, eBay affiliate links on uh, have to be in here now if you've got a whole bunch of uh, say AdSense sites for example you want to put the uh, the affiliate links in what you might want to do first off is just kind of test the waters a bit put in a couple of websites and it's real simple you click here again fill in the blanks remember it doesn't cost you a dime just a little bit of time and you can see I've got a couple of different websites in here uh, but the main thing you're going to need is this PID and anytime that you use this PID for this website any affiliate links that you generate they have to go onto this website because if you put uh, affiliate links that were generated f with this PID onto say in my example this website the links will work but the commissions will not come to you so basically bottom line is not going to work so the affiliate links are website um, well, what would be the word specific there you go. Um, so this PID is only going to work uh, for this website and not for any other ones that you have in here. So keep that in mind as you're going along. Now after you've added your websites, uh, basically all you're in need of is this PID. What we want to do though is we want to go and log into eBay and go to the, uh, the help section here and then once this page pops up what you want to do then is you want to type in um, editor kit yeah just like that is and when you hit search at the time of the, me creating this video uh, I had 11 help, to help topics pop up uh, under editor kit what you want to do is you want to click on the very top on your eBay affiliate program which uh, is right here and then after this pops up what you want to do is and of course you can read all this if you want to but I'm not because of the video link click on editors kit then this comes up this here is the eBay affiliate program and by all means when you get a chance to there's a whole lot of learning going on in here um, but for the sake of the video we're mainly interested in getting that live listing up on our website so then you'd hit create an editor kit and this comes up and this is called the snippet and this is basically where you're going to create that editor or the uh, display for your website and by all means like everything else I've mentioned go through here and read all this good stuff and set everything up most of it's pretty self-explanatory but that PID I had mentioned earlier that's going to go right in here and the uh, SID because here you want to choose whoever you signed up with in this case it was Commission Junction and put your PID 
and then the SID is simply a name you're going to give to this particular campaign which comes in handy later on if you're going to be doing any tracking of your results and in my case I might put uh, uh, how to info for you main page for lack of a better imagination and the other thing I want to point out here is if you are currently selling on eBay and you want to uh, advertise or have a live listing on your website of your eBay store or your eBay listings then what you want to do then is under content selection here where it says show more search options they kinda hid it from you but click on that and items from these sellers this is where you put in your ID your eBay ID in my case it would be as well, let me just show you up here at the top of the page this is the ID they're referring to so by you putting your eBay ID whichever one you want to use because if you don't know you can have as well I've got four different eBay IDs but anyway this is the one I would put in here and that way the listings that would pop up on this live listing would only be from those that were in here um, and you can you can uh, specify even further by limiting it by price or by putting in search words so for example if I've got a gazillion items on my uh, in my eBay store but I only want to advertise those dealing with software then I would put in software here and it would only bring up those within my store or the stores listed here with software as a keyword and of course here you can put in if I got software in the description as well as the title those two would come up aside from that the rest of this here just play around with and just kinda give you an idea on uh, what all it may look like let me just kinda go to my website here the how to info for you dot com and I'll show you what it looks like on my website okay I went ahead and pulled up my website that I have that eBay uh, snippet if you will our live listings on and let me see here just scroll down all the way down here to the bottom and this is basically the way I have mine set up I've got the price the description and the gallery I do not have the time left or the um, uh, number of bids and if you hit this and that'll bring up all the rest of them now one of the reasons why and of course you can customize all this up here too a couple of points to ponder on though the title that you put up here may have some bearing on the search engine optimization points this can uh, bring to your website I bring that up because whenever I first had this website launched and did not have the eBay listing on here I was ranking on the uh, Google search engine somewhere between the first and second page but usually at the bottom of the first page top of the second page so it was respectable but not at the top of the page as soon as I put this on there and had this title listed as one of my keywords within this page within this web page I shot to the top I'm currently number one on the uh, on using these terms here uh, as a keyword phrase number one been there since I put this on there as you can see this is not prominently displayed on my website it's at the bottom in the center of my web page so you might want to consider that too uh, not only f having this on your website to earn potential affiliate commissions but also to boost your rankings in the search engines so that's something you might want to consider too whenever you're uh, uh, thinking about what kind of title you're going to put on your eBay live listings now this was a pretty quick synopsis of how to get your dynamic eBay uh, listings on your web page so if you do happen to have any questions or suggestions or comments on how you can um, on any further details on how to get your eBay listings on your website here's my email address uh, that's steve at howtoinfoforyou.com or you can go ahead and uh, uh, comment on this video by all means as much as you'd like to and I'd be more than happy to get back to you with all the details you need to get your eBay listings on your website thank you very much and you have a great day